Good afternoon, uh, Andrew <coughs> Berry, I'm the Selvin, Selvage Unit Manager for Maritime New Zealand. Uh, today's uh, briefing, just want to take you through uh, uh, some activities that have occurred today. This slide here shows uh, activity uh, aboard the Rena yesterday, and uh, of note is the, uh, the calm weather and lack of a swell. Again, uh, from a uh, slightly different perspective, uh, the weather certainly there favourable for pumping, uh, which was occurring at that stage. This is a photo uh, that we took uh, just after first light this morning. Winds this morning were over 30 knots with swells of 2 to 4 metres. Um, overnight, the salvers uh, uh, indicated that the conditions had worsened and the uh, bunker barge Awanuia was no longer able to remain safely attached to the rear of the arena. She let go uh, her mooring lines and also the fuel transfer hose, which you can see uh, trailing off the stern of the vessel. The salvers remained aboard. Um, until uh, the early hours of this morning when uh, another set of salvers were put on board. The decision was made to secure the ship, uh, to close the manhole cover into the fuel tank, close the watertight doors and then to leave the ship. As of this afternoon there are no salvers aboard the vessel and uh, the salvers have just advised their intention not to reboard the vessel today and to attempt that again at first light tomorrow morning when conditions are hopefully uh, will have abated. Today, uh, other activities that have been, that have been going on uh, while the salvers have been off the ship have been uh, some regular uh, flights over the ship to monitor uh, the starboard crack, which uh, you can see here under the uh, white container, and this crack here on the port side. Um, that's also been done by ship this afternoon. The uh, ship remains uh, in a very dynamic state uh, while the, uh, the forward section remains firmly uh, pinned to Astrolabe Reef. The stern section uh, does move uh, backwards and forwards to some degree with both the waves and the change of tide. Here you'll see the uh, starboard crack which is, uh, which is being monitored. Um, Unfortunately, with the, uh, the, pre the present weather conditions, the, uh, this side of the vessel is uh, taking some force of, uh, of swells uh, onto that starboard side. You'll also note the uh, bulbous bow section. This is uh, damage that we noted uh, a few days ago, um, and uh, this is, uh, bow section is being pushed up to port, up to the left, as the rest of the, uh, the bow sits on top of it. Finally, uh, the shot from this morning uh, shows a light oil sheen um, with small amounts of darker oil in it. Uh, it's coming from uh, the arena and is moving out to sea with the prevailing wind um, and uh, is uh, naturally breaking up uh, thanks to the waves um, within two to three kilometres of the ship. Uh, we just uh, 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 for your information, I've brought with us uh, some of the uh, piping equipment uh, that's uh, an example of what's been used uh, aboard uh, the arena. This length of hose here is, uh, is what is, uh, is used by the salvers um, for long lengths of, uh, of the transfer of fuel from the, uh, from the uh, tank uh, onto the Awanuia. Larger uh, length of uh, hose is the uh, is reinforced hose, which is uh, designed to go around corners and down into places like the tank. And uh, this is just an indication of the, the strength uh, required uh, for the pumping operation. That said, um, uh, if the Arunuia was to remain uh, uh, in the stern of the, uh, the arena um, and pull on either pieces of these uh, pipe that pipe could uh, quite easily rupture, which is uh, one of the reasons that uh, the Awanuia had to uh, disengage last night.
Finally, uh, the, uh, whilst uh, there are no salvers aboard the ship uh, this afternoon or overnight, um, the, uh, the tugs remain, one tug remains connected to the stern of the arena, and uh, there is electronic monitoring equipment also aboard the ship, which is able to tell us how the ship is moving or orienting um, over time, and, uh, and the salvers are able to engage the, uh, the relative movements, especially with that stern section.